Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're playing Fortnite, Valorant, or CS2 and notice that your CPU is running at 90 to 100% while your GPU is barely being used, then you've got a classic low GPU usage and high CPU usage problem. That usually causes stutters, low FPS, and just an overall bad experience. Don't worry. In this video, I'll walk you through step-by-step -step how to fix it and get your games running smoothly. So, without wasting any more time, let's get started. First thing, make sure your PC isn't stuck in power saving mode. Go to Windows Windows search, type power plan, and set it to high performance or ultimate performance. This makes sure your CPU and GPU aren't being throttled by Windows. Next, update your graphics drivers. Open GeForce Experience if you're on NVIDIA, or Adrenaline if you're on AMD, and install the latest driver. For NVIDIA users, open Control Panel. Manage 3D settings. Set Power Management Mode to Prefer Maximum Performance, and Low Latency Mode to On. That alone can fix a lot of CPU bottleneck issues in competitive shooters. Now, one of the big reason why your CPU is maxed out is because of settings. In Fortnite, Valorant, and CS2, turn shadows and post processing down. Those hammer your CPU. Keep textures and effects higher. Those use your GPU more. In Fortnite, set view distance to medium. In Valorant and CS2, keep VSync off and make sure multi-threaded rendering is turned on. That spreads the load across all CPU cores. Now turn on GPU scheduling. Go to Settings, System, Display, Graphics Settings, and turn on Hardware Accelerated GPU Scheduling. Restart your PC after that. It lets your GPU take some work off the CPU and usually helps with smoother frames. Now close background apps. Check Task Manager and shut down unnecessary stuff like Chrome, Discord Overlay, Xbox Game Bar, or anything eating CPU in the background. This frees up resources for your game. Now adjust Windows Gaming Tweaks. Turn on Game Mode in Windows Settings. Disable Xbox Game Bar and Background Recording under the Capture Settings. Also, if you want maximum performance, go to Performance Options and set it to Adjust for Best Performance, so Windows doesn't waste CPU on animations. Now check your CPU core. Sometimes the game isn't using all your CPU cores. So, go into search bar now, type here, System Configuration, then go into Boot Tab Details tab, then Advanced Option. Now check number of the processors and choose the highest number that's shown on your PC. That way, the game can use your CPU properly. Now use Reflex or Anti-Lag. In Fortnite, Valorant, and CS2, enable NVIDIA Reflex if you're on NVIDIA, or Anti-Lag if you're on AMD. These reduce CPU overhead and give you lower latency at the same time. Now monitor usage. Use MSI Afterburner and Riva Tuner to monitor your CPU and GPU usage in-game. Ideally, you want your GPU usage above 90%. If the CPU is still maxing out while GPU CPU is low, that means you're hitting a CPU bottleneck, and you'll need to tweak CPU heavy settings more. And that's it. After these tweaks, your GPU should finally start working harder and your CPU should calm down, which means smoother FPS in Fortnite, Valorant, and CS2. If this video helped you, drop a like, subscribe for more optimization guides, and let me know in the comments what kind of FPS boost you got.